There were tears of joy, sadness, and everything in between at the 2024 Paris Olympic Games. So let's highlight the biggest moments and storylines from the Games. You're never too old to go for gold. At 37 years old, Serbia's Novak Djokovic captured the elusive Olympics gold medal he needed to complete his career Golden Slam. Love was in the air. American Tara Davis Woodhull took home gold in the women's long jump, but she won the world over when she fell into the sand to soak in the moment and then made a beeline for her husband's arms in the stands. Bling was the thing for Paris, and whether it was Simone Biles' goat chain, Jordan Charles' matching gold nails and grills, or Sha'Carri Richardson's custom press-ons, the athletes didn't come to France to play around with their accessories. America's new favorite sweetheart, Steven Nadarosic, aka Pommel Horse Guy, aka Clark Kent, became an internet sensation with his penguin dance to loosen up before his bronze medal winning performance. Fans knew when the glasses came off, it was go time. Snoop Dogg wins gold as the best celeb fan at the Olympics. Between the rare Olympic pin or his adventures around events at the Paris Games, we'll know he'll show out at the LA 2028 Games in his hometown. Algerian boxer Aman Khalif was targeted in a gender eligibility controversy after Italian boxer Angela Carini left their bout just 46 seconds in. The IOC defended the boxer and discredited the International Boxing Association's claims. Khalif won Olympic gold. The U.S. women broke records. American Sydney McLaughlin Larone won gold and broke her world record for the sixth time in the 400 meter hurdles. Katie Ledecky became the most decorated U.S. female Olympic athlete and set a record in the 1500 meter race. Olivia Rees lifted over three times her weight, won gold, and set a record in the snatch at 258 pounds. Simone Biles racked up medals and became the most decorated American gymnast with 11 Olympic medals. American Noah Lyles became the fastest man in the world with a photo finish victory in the men's 100 meters, but several days later he went on to race in the 200 meters with COVID and finished in third place. It was a France first America showdown for both the men and women's basketball teams with the Americans coming out on top. The men's team took down host country France for a fifth straight gold while the women took home their eighth straight. Hey, thanks for watching. If you like this video, check out these other videos from USA Today to stay up to date with all the latest news.